Well, this Thursday isn't just Thanksgiving. It's also the start of Hanukkah and a gigantic celestial coincidence. So this is a special Hanukkah this year. So for some ways to make it rock and stand out, we are joined this morning by lifestyle expert Justine Santanella. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank How you are so you? much for having me. I'm great. But this is high class that we got here. I, I like that I you, I like wanna, that you noticed. I don't want to touch the table because right. I tend to break Don't things, touch so. anything. This is celebrating Hanukkah in style. A little yeah. more unique, a little more chic than your traditional Hanukkah stuff that we've seen forever. A little mm -hmm. different. So let's start with your table setting, okay? okay? That makes the tone for the entire meal. And instead of just doing a boring table setting, the whole thing you wanna do is mix and match. Colors, patterns, textures. So here we did a blue and white pattern for the placemat and for the napkin. Those are from Sur La Table. And then these might just be plain white plates here, but as you can see, we have a star bowl. Makes the entire place setting, and these are all from Lorena Gaxiola. Love her stuff. And you can see all blue and white, but all mixed yeah. and matched. But you're not overthinking it. The food looks prettiest on a white plate. I think so. Yeah. I love a white plate. I've it heard lets a lot the, of chefs say that. It lets the food speak for itself. And then also, little rock glasses could be used Ooh. for flameless candles like we have here. And then these will project the color of the glasses onto like a white tablecloth. Beautiful. Then you have, again, your white and blue theme. Love this. So now you're really setting the tone for the meal. But then, of course, you can't forget your centerpiece. Yes. Floral centerpiece makes the entire tablescape. Blue and white again. Of course, again. blue, white, silvers. Now, I ordered this on bloomnation.com. They're great. You can order locally from top floral designers. Now, this is actually local from a woman in Waterbury, Connecticut. Her name mm -hmm. is Susan Ochina from the Dutch Flower Lady. She made this special and unique just for us. Wonderful. Isn't this Thanks. gorgeous? So now your table setting is complete. And also, by the way, you can move this floral arrangement from room to room. This way you have decor everywhere. Okay. Okay. Well, moving on, what do we have? A gift shaker? ideas. Yeah. So gift ideas, hostess gifts as well. So a little cocktail shaker here from Michael Aram. As you can see, the star detailing makes it. But what I love about this as a gift is you don't just have to use it for Hanukkah. You yeah. can use it all year long, <laughs> oh, yes, yes, right? Well, especially yeah. if you like cocktails. And I like the menorahs too. It menorahs, so beautiful. But out of the box menorahs, a little more modern, a little more interesting. So this one is Michael Aram as well. This is about $159. Looks like a tree. They call it the tree of life. I love that. And then this one here is Mackenzie Childs. So gorgeous. And what's great about a menorah is you can pass this down to your kids, their kids. You so have it forever. So they do become heirlooms. Exactly. And gorgeous and elegant. And also a great idea for a gift, this tray here, this acrylic tray. Now you can see instead of doing a traditional Hanukkah pattern on here, we did a blue and white chevron. And then you can personalize it with the family's name like we have in front. Okay. You can put pictures in there. Really cool and chic. And lastly, there's more to wine than Manischewitz. What do we of for the Of course. Country? Now, I think if you're going to be giving a bottle of wine to a hostess for Hanukkah, you got to get a blue wine bottle, right? Mm -hmm. So we have a great Moscato here. Of course, it's kosher. Yep. But then go the step further. And that's a dessert wine, too. I mean, yes, that's the... that makes the dessert at the end. You want to give a little wine stopper with it. Again, this, to me, looks a little bit like a menorah. Or you could even put one of these personalized labels on it. Put these personalized labels on gift boxes and bags to take it to the next level for your wrapping. Excellent. Thank you very much Thank for your you time, Justine. Thank you so Justine. much. And there you have it. Everything you knew, everything you need for the perfect tonic.